Hi everyone, Thomas here and welcome back to another video. So today I'm back here for another speed build and today we're going to go ahead and create this cosy cottage. So if you'd like to go ahead and download this for yourself, it is up on the gallery now. My origin ID is real Thomas TV one So like I said, this home is called a cosy cottage. Um, now you can see the spelling is with a Z or Z, whatever, however you say it. Um, now in the UK we say it like with an S, um, so C-O-S-Y. And I kind of always have that kind of dilemma whether I should use the American or the British spelling for words and titles and stuff. Another example is colour. Oh god, I can't speak. Another example is colour. Um, so we have a U in it and the Americans don't. So I always kind of don't know if I should use the American or not. Um, and I know the majority of my viewers are from the US. So I kind of just tend to go for that. Um, but then with my, you know, UK viewers, it looks like I'm a little bit. So <laughs> um, I never know which one to use. But um, this is what we're going for today. It's the same word at the end of the day. I don't really think it matters that much. <laughs> so this home is pretty small, as you can see. It's just on a 30 by 20 lot, um, but there's kind of still quite a bit of space around it to do landscaping and stuff. Um, and the idea of this home is basically just kind of like a small little room, I guess. Not a room. Where, where did that come from? A small little home. <laughs> um, and I just kind of like sometimes doing these sort of homes, especially when I'm doing mansion builds every week, which can be pretty tiring. It is nice to do, you know, some smaller builds every now and again. And I just want to point out at this point in the video, you might see quite a bit of lag, but don't worry, it only lasts for like well, about another minute, some bits are better than others, um, but around the three minute mark, we switch over to OBS. Um, I'm going to explain why that all happened in a second with my recording software. Um, so basically what happened was I was recording with DX3, which is my normal, you know, recording software or DX toy, however you say it. Um, it's basically just another version of Fraps. Um, and every now and again, I'll have this problem where the frame rate will just drop to like two. Um, and sometimes, well, the thing is just that I don't notice it at all because I don't get any lag on my game while that's happening so I can't really tell unless I look up in the top right corner where like it has the um the frame counter whilst I'm recording um you can't see it on screen but it is for me and um, when I'm like recording um and it said like zero I was like um okay and this sometimes happens and it's so so frustrating because I might do so much in the build and then I'm kind of like well I can't really include this in the footage because it's like, you know, you can't really watch it. Um, but luckily I managed to see it not too far in the build. So we do switch over to OBS, which you will probably know it's a little bit like a difference in the quality because um, I do use this recording software because it is amazing quality but that problem happens sometimes and I don't really know what it is because I have enough disk space I have all that sort of stuff which is fine so I don't really know why that happens so I switched over to OBS just to be on the safe side um, and hopefully it still looks all okay and stuff like that um, but yeah so what else can I talk about well, I, well hang on <laughs> I'm all over the place um, I did mention in yesterday's build if I don't know if it's well, hopefully the Maxton Mansion build, which should have went up yesterday for you, it's going up in like six hours for me because I'm recording this on the 27th. I think this is going up on the 28th. Um, so anyway, I was going to mention about seasons in that build um, because, you know, it, it's like very recent and exciting news. Um, but I kind of just ran out of time in that build to be able to talk about it. So I mentioned at the very end that I was going to try and talk about it in today's build. Um, so yeah, Seasons is coming officially. I cannot believe, well actually I can believe it <laughs> because, um, you know, we've had a lot of speculation about it. Um, but you know, just that feeling of it being official is amazing and I'm so, so excited. And I cannot believe it's literally coming in less than a month, like for an expansion pack. Like that's crazy. So I'm so glad we don't have to wait any longer. Um, to be honest, like when we got the announcement for Cats and Dogs in August, um, last year and that was coming out on November 10th uh, you know it seemed like in August like oh my god it's gonna be such a long wait but it kind of went over very quickly um so I wouldn't have minded if that happened I mean of course I want it like now but you know what I mean if that happened and it was gonna be you know a few months down the line then that'll be fine for me because they will probably go over pretty quickly um but anyway you know I'm really happy that it's coming on June the 22nd that's just after my exams are finished which is on the 18th of June um but yeah so I'm really really excited I've got so many builds planned like crazy amount of builds um i think at the minute i've got about 25 i think it is i'm just going to check on my kind of list here i have this like google spreadsheet i've mentioned this a million times but i have this google spreadsheet where basically i keep track of all my builds and well all videos actually i um, have the upload date of that build and the title of it so i can kind of see everything um, and then i have a few more columns for like build ideas create some ideas other ideas and stuff like that um so i'm just going to scroll down a bit and try and find where i've got all my ideas down for um and i said cats and dogs <laughs> for seasons um so 
it's just taking a minute to load. So I've got, um, let's see, 24. So that's kind of a lot. And then we've also kind of got some more ideas for the new glass roof as well. So if you don't know, we're all getting a new glass roof um, as not like a decoration or anything. It's like a literal, you know, roof texture thing in the roof menu. Um, and that is coming as a free update. So I'm so, so excited for that. Um, and that'll be, I don't know when that's coming, but you know, probably sometime in the next couple of weeks, I would imagine, before Cats and Dogs. Um, so I said Cats and Dogs again <laughs> before Seasons. So um, I can't wait for that. And I have like, well, I have one build idea I could do with that um, glass roof type thing. Um, but I do have a few more that I haven't written down. So I'm going to do that later. Um, anyway, so like you said, th well, at this point here, well, a little while ago, we changed over to OBS. I don't really think you can notice so much dip, like in terms of quality. Um, but, you know, I think it's a little bit less laggy, which is great. Um, so we're just working on this bedroom here. And one aim for this home was just to make it like really cluttered and well decorated. Um, and that's why the kind of cozy comes into it, because I wanted to make it small for me to be able to do that. Because I don't know why, but I just love using clutter sometimes. I don't use it as much in my mansion builds because I'd be there all day trying to, you know, fill every single room up with clutter in those big worlds. But... This kind of gives me the opportunity to do that, which is great. Um, and yeah, so another thing I want to mention is that on Saturday, if you haven't seen it, I posted a very, very quick video. It was like a minute and 40 seconds. Um, talking about this new series that I'm starting called Fix Me Thomas TV. That's a hashtag that you can use on the gallery to go ahead and submit your rundown lots for me to go ahead and renovate on a video. Um, so the series kind of came about a little while ago. I kind of, you know, mentioned the idea on Twitter to see what people thought about it. And everybody seemed up for it. Um, I just really wanted to start something different on my channel which would kind of be a little bit more interactive with you all so that's what we're doing um and i've got like it's been like less than 24 hours since i mentioned like since the video went up because i'm this is kind of a little bit pre-recorded um but because it's currently sunday that i'm recording this on and yesterday so i posted it and i've got like three builds already which doesn't sound a lot but you know for under 24 hours and i didn't even think well that was kind of my worry about it and um, that's why i ran the idea over on twitter first to see what people thought about it because i didn't want to kind of make the announcement video and stuff and then nobody submits lots which is still kind of a little bit of a worry because i know that you know everybody's gonna be excited about it now i'll probably get a few more submissions and i feel like it's going to die off which is a worry but i'm hoping it's not so if you do have any even older builds that you've done and can just sit in your library or something because i had somebody mention to me that they have like a few builds that they've done before um and can you put up in the gallery like rundown ones um so maybe you could you know re-upload that with the hashtag so i can find it if you have that that's fine um so a few people have kind of submitted like homes and also kind of uh, I was going to say residential art, community lot. So like an art centre and a karaoke bar as well, which is pretty interesting. Um, it's a little bit different than just house lots, which is going to be great. And yeah, so if you have any ideas, feel free to submit that. Now, one thing I want to mention is that, and well, nobody's mentioned this yet, but I, I kind of had a little bit of a worry yesterday because I realised, like, I went onto the gallery to search the hashtag up um, and I kind of typed in fix me and then I saw Lil Simsy and I totally forgot that um, Kayla has that series with that same hashtag, fix me Lil Simsy, um, which I had absolutely no idea about. Like, I, I knew of the series and stuff, but I didn't realise that was the hashtag when I made it. I just made mine fix me Thomas TV because it kind of flows nice, if that makes sense. Um, so... I'm not copying her in any way, please don't think that. Um, so I'm hoping that nobody kind of leaves me hate about that. <laughs> um, but you know, it's only a hashtag at the end of the day. And yeah, and I know that a few other people do this type of series as well. So um, I'm, not, I'm not the only one. And yeah, so we're just working on kind of like putting some finishing touches onto the outside here, um, like some ivy and stuff, which I actually haven't used in a little while. Um, I mean, not that long, but just not on any of my like couple of last builds, I haven't really put that much ivy in. Um, and it's kind of, you know, a nice little... Um, sort of feature and adds a little bit more detail to your builds um, and as you can see we're working on landscaping here I've got the full process in so you can see how I do landscaping I am actually planning on doing a landscaping tutorial pretty soon because I know a few people have been asking about that and also for roofing so make sure you stay tuned because I'll be doing some tutorials on that um, and yeah so what's it just about my oh yeah that was it so, um, when I went in to do this build originally, I was just going to do a base game in cats and dogs. Um, and then I was kind of thinking, well, you know what? I really wanted to use this ivy in this particular thing, and it's from Get Together. So, I kind of just ditched the idea, but I did <laughs> try to pay attention a little bit to what kind of packs I was do you know, using and stuff. Um, and it's really annoying because on the gallery, I did end up using a few packs where I just used, like, one item from it. Um, you know the little spice rack that we got with Cool Kitchen stuff on, the like, the wall decoration? I used that without thinking about it. So, if you don't have... Uh, this is kind of like a weird 
thought process but i feel like people will see that on the gallery maybe they don't have the pack but then they don't decide to download the build because they feel like oh i'm there's going to be stuff missing so i won't download it even though it was only that one tiny little decoration so that's why i sometimes pay attention to how much of a pack i'm using um so i can kind of avoid it so people can actually download it without that worry um even though it's only one lot i don't know if that makes sense but i always struggle to explain that to people i don't know why but anyway so we're pretty much finished with the build here i really hope you enjoyed in the comment section down below let me know what, what you thought of and if you have any more ideas for builds or videos or even builds and videos that you want to see with a seasons expansion pack come out soon let me know and i'll make a note of that and hopefully get around to it um and yeah so thanks for watching leave a like share and subscribe if you haven't and go ahead and download this from the sims 4 gallery my origin id is real thomas tv1 and i'll see you all next time bye